A poignant tragedy involving two families in Russia. An investigation has started in Russia after it emerged that two babies had been mixed up at birth in a maternity hospital 12 years ago. The two families involved have already launched a civil case against the hospital. From the town of Kopeysk in the Ural Mountains, Steve Rosenberg has the details. Family photos normally bring back happy memories. But for Yulia Belayeva, the past has turned into a nightmare. She's discovered that her 12-year-old daughter Irina, the girl she thought she'd given birth to, is not her child. I found this out when my ex-husband refused to pay maintenance. I took him to court to prove that he was Irina's father. We did DNA tests, but the results were a total surprise. Not only does my ex-husband have no biological link to Irina, neither do I. Police believe that 12 years ago there had been a terrible mix-up at the local maternity hospital, that two babies had been given the wrong name tags and the wrong parents. The whole world had turned upside down. I kept worrying what Irina would say, and I kept thinking about my real daughter. Maybe she'd been abandoned or put in an orphanage, or perhaps she was begging on the streets. If Yulia Bilaeva had been given the wrong baby, then where was her real daughter? She was desperate to find out. So she went to the police, and they began a search for her biological child. Within weeks, they'd found her, living just a few miles away, in this house. Oh. Anya had been brought up a devout Muslim. She thought her father was Naimat Iskanderov. When the police told him about the mistake at the maternity hospital, Naimat didn't want to believe it. Then, the detective showed me a photo of the other girl, Irina, the one they said was my real daughter. When I saw her face, it was like seeing myself. My arms and legs began shaking. It was awful to think that my child had grown up with another family and that I'd brought up someone else's daughter. The two families have now met and are getting to know each other. Together, they're suing the hospital and struggling to come to terms with what's happened. I try to show Anya motherly love, but she doesn't accept it. She's been brought up differently. We don't really understand each other. And when your own daughter looks at you like a stranger, that's so painful. It is difficult. They're Christian, we are Muslim, we have different customs. I'm worried that my girl will end up drinking in bars, that she'll stop praying and working hard. I'm frightened she'll lose her religion. The girls say they don't want to swap parents. They're just happy to have found each other. <laughs> we were a bit shy at first, Irina says, but we're now the best of friends. They were born 15 minutes apart. Now the truth about what happened in hospital has brought them together. Steve Rosenberg, BBC News, Kapiesk, Russia.